sleep with you rolling and tossing. Well, Dad Bryant, I can't help it. This confounded couch is plumb alive. Every time I get in another position, it sprouts another hair. Look at that. Brother, come on out. He tried to kill me. He was Walker's accomplice. We knew he was hiding out near Virginia City. Well, I wouldn't count on catching that boat, Dr. Strasser. Why? We lost the horses. Well, my brother and the others are trying to find him. How's he? His collarbone is shattered. Several ribs broken. And he may have serious internal injuries. You just had to kill somebody, didn't you? He was trying to help Walker escape. I had my eye on him ever since I spotted him in Virginia City. I never knew suspicion could rot a man's mind. You really believe that, huh? All right, have it your way. I killed Cutler in cold blood. Are you satisfied? You want to kill yourself? Lay back. All we ever asked of you was to have a little compassion for the prisoner. Compassion? You mean feel sorry for him? Well, now, is there anything wrong with that? He's used this trick before, on Cora. Cora? My wife. I killed her with that shotgun. Well, now, what's that got to do with Walker? Because he worked his ways on her, too. Before I could get him back to Los Angeles for the murder of a paymaster, she tried to release him. And he deliberately pushed her in my line of fire to save his own rotten skin. Now we know the reason for the chains and the beatings. If you believe it, Doctor. It's not gonna work, Dad. You go from brutality to sentiment and I don't buy it. Cartwright! Take that. Well, what's that for? I'm deputizing you. You take Walker back to Los Angeles. 
You mean you want me to take your place? That's what I mean. But you, you can't deputize somebody like this. Can I? The United States Marshal has the authority to deputize any citizen. And if I refuse? You can't refuse. It's your duty to take that badge. And you are bound by law to accept and carry out any reasonable commission.